Hello mga bossing, welcome back sa, sa video natin. Today, tuturo ko sa inyo kung paano nyo ba magamit yung Grammarly sa mga job applications natin. Ano ba yung Grammarly? Ang Grammarly guys, ito yung uh, parang grammar checker ng isang, isang extension natin sa Google Google Chrome. Ito yung Grammarly. So, makita natin dyan sa taas. So, naka-activate na siya. So, ito yung website. Basically, ito yung nagsusupport sa'yo when it comes to checking our grammar kung tama ba o mali yung grammar natin. Kasi nga, hindi naman natin sure kung tama yung grammar natin. So, dapat may tool tayo na ganito. So, ito din talaga yung tool na ginagamit ko ever since. Kasi nga, hindi naman talaga ako marunong. Hindi naman talaga ako 100% na marunong din sa grammar. So, there mga times din na nagkakamali tayo. So, may mga tao din naman na well-versed naman din sa grammar. Pero, kung hindi ka sure sa grammar na ginagamit, ginagamit mo, you can just install this application or extension sa Google natin. So, ano ba yung trabaho ni Grammarly? So, example, if you're if you're going to go here sa online jobs, if we check natin to, i-try natin mag-apply. So, ito yung lalabas, di ba? Okay, so, let's click on that one sa apply for this job. And then, di ba, alam nyo naman to, di ba? So, application for Facebook Ads Expert. And then, then nakita nyo yan? ito yung tinatawag na ang function ng extension natin. So, if ever na mag-type kayo, hello, basically, yung gamit ng extension natin is i-check lang yung grammar nyo kung mali ba hindi. So, example ito ang gagamit natin. Hello, good morning. Are you looking for for the uh, job Facebook? Oh, so, nakita mo dyan. <laughs> ang trabaho ni Grammarly is basically i-check yung grammar mo kung mali ba hindi. So, example for this one are you looking for a facebook for the job so mali talaga so mali talaga yung ano ang grammar niya so so example ganito um is the job still available use example magkamali tayo sa grammar let's say for example um i am Yan. So, automatic ma-detect ni Grammarly yung error mo. So, ano bang gamit mo? I-drag mo lang yung mouse dyan. And then, i-click mo itong naka-green. Then, so, ayan na. So, let's try to go to Facebook. The good thing about this is, pwede, pwede mo siyang mag-imitin din sa mga status mo. Let's say, for example, are you looking for as the job so yan example yan so makita natin dyan na magka error na siya oh see so, so for example ito yung status po where are you going so basically itatrack din ni Grammarly yung yung error mo so that's a good thing about this next thing that we need to do is we need to install Grammarly sa Google Chrome natin so ngayon pupunta ako dito sa isang Google Chrome ko ito yung Google Chrome natin in order for you to install the extension you need to go to Google and then click mo itong dot long dots then go to more tools and then type mo, i-click mo yung extensions pag maklik mo na yung extensions pumunta ka naman dito sa dot long uh, lines like hamburger and then open mo yung web store then after mo ma-open yung web store so ito yung mga mga extension na available sa google na pwede mong gamitin sa extension mo nakalagay dito so ito yung google chrome na to guys wala pa siyang extension so ang gawin natin um, i-type natin yung grammarly after mo ma-type yung grammarly so search mo dyan and then i-click mo lang yung add to chrome once mag-pop up yan siya, so i-click mo tong sabihin mo lang add extension so basically para mag-download yan it dito so after mo mag-download yan just wait for it to load okay so after that install mo na automatic siya mag-install sa'yo yan so mag-grammarly ka na so all you need to do is sign up first so gamitin mo yung email na ginagamit mo and then may nakalagay dyan, sign up or continue with google so kung nakalagin ka na sa google mo all you need to do is click mo lang yung continue with google then after that it will ask you to to log in or to click that one you need to click that account 
and then yun uh, of my writing is for work click mo yung continue I want to help with the spelling and grammar uh, pwede mo siya i-check lahat pero pwede mo na lang tong i-check yung spelling and grammar Okay, so once ma okay na yan siya, continue to Grammarly and it's free. Pwede din gamitin mo yan for na mag gusto mo magbayad. So pag mag gamit mo na ng Grammarly, so naka-install na yan siya guys, meaning kung pupunta ka sa mga Facebook or sa mga Twitter or any app na gusto mo, pwede mo na siyang magamit kasi nga naka-on na yung, ex yung extension mo. Yan, so ang the good thing about this Grammarly as well is that you can also write um, example kung article writer ka or blog writer ka you can simply um, go here sa, ano, sa new document and then lagi mo ng title dyan title here and then yan my name is Jake ganun now makita yun yung error nya let's say for example maliin mo virtual assistant so makita natin na mali yung word natin so pang click nya then sa virtual then you're good you're good to go so that's how easy it is to use the Grammarly if you want to install this you can just simply go to again sa sa tools more tools and then sa extension extension and then you can just type in Grammarly so I really suggest that as early as now may Grammarly na kayo para hindi na kayo mahirapan along the way when it comes to when it comes to doing your job applications so it's really important to have this tool now para mag-guidean ka naman din sa when it comes to writing your a professional letter mag-guidean ka sa when it comes to your grammar as well so and that's it for this video and see you on the next videos